Welcome back. GXR and Army Genius is an arguably the most exciting series of the night. Very, very happy to see these two teams against each other. UK needs to be very cautious with his positioning. They can get a lot of damage out very quickly and he might just be dead. He's going to try and run. Polison, he'll have another soul assumption out. And that'll be another kill for Polison. Lackey's going for an early rotation though. Yeah, he's got the coil up. They're going to throw it out immediately into the silence and the rolling thunder. They know who their target is. In fact, they even found the ogre. Do they have the damage though? Grave Chiller's there, they'll slow him down, and yeah, they'll definitely have the damage. UK, he knows he's dead. Doesn't really have a Bloodlust to offer, but he just wants to make sure Mamung Dai does remain safe, as they might be able to land a stun, but the silence is out. Mamung Dai now going to be in danger. Soul Assumption does connect with a massive Dream Coil. They do bar a strike in, but it's not going to be enough. UK gets cleaned up. Wami, he's going to try with the Epicenter. He will kill off Polison, but it's for the cost of his own life. Smoke out. From GXR into the top jungle could find something big. Good dream coil could be a great setup here. Lacrity is just gonna move right into that LYM Marana. And, well, that's a very nice orb to move forward as he gets a coil blind onto the Sand King. And now with the familiars, you're gonna be able to get the vision. He's gonna go for the TP, but you've got the stuns. The familiars, they don't just deal damage and get you vision and fly over everything, John, but they also stun. Well, they're gonna start moving up towards that top lane, it looks like, AG. The smoke up is five. Oh, they're going to run right into Polis, and it's not quite the target you'd love to start on. They might have to just accept it, though, and he is actually quite tanky. He is going to drop, though. A nice pickup. That looks like it might just be about it, unless GXR are going to move in, and yeah, they are. They're going to force a fight. They get the, the uh, coil off right onto the PLDB. He's going to be okay, though, to just back himself out, as now the Rolling Thunder is not really connecting on much. And so this team fight, it feels very oh. forced, and now the FP center's there from Wami. Back in on Mizun in your dream, but they kind of ignore it altogether. Go back on the Sand King. They'll lose Joe Camp. But it's a one for two trade. AG, it's not the best trade in the world, but it's also not bad considering how far behind you are. Mizu though, he's jumping in for a bit more. Problem is he's been perma stunned up and Mamung Daya is going to be able to clean up that kill. But they're moving on to UK. They'll get the gyrocopter, but now in your dream, he doesn't want to die. But he will lose the Aegis and they may have overextended. Alacrity, he's still around. They're going to move in. Silence is out onto the PO arrow. It's still going to land. Oh, in your dream, he thought he was, he was getting blocked by the familiars. Oh, Paulson's going to drop as well. They just... Yeah, there's the pings out. Epicenter ready. Dragon form in about 10 seconds. As long as one of those spells are up, they can kind of just look for the fight. Mizu, nice stun out. Or rather, stun onto Mizu. Barra strikes there. Coil though, gonna lock four of them down. And now in your dreams, gonna move in with the flat cannon. There goes LYM. They even save Mizu on the gyro. Or rather, the rolling, uh, the pango. His DB, he's gonna try and kill off Joe Camp. But he's been caught out and he's gonna drop as well. Onto UK. They'll swap him in. They've got the Yogan. They'll take him down. Yeah. Fun fact, but in fact, hold that thought, because. We are about to get into a fight. DB definitely doesn't want to get caught right now. And UK, he's going to break the smoke, but the Dream Core is already there, and they've got the PO and a great swap out. Guaranteed stun onto DB, but he will survive, at least for now. The call down still dropping in your dream. He's going to go for the chase DB. Epicenter's there. Wami, he's going to try and save the day, but he can't do it. They can't get through in your dream on this gyrocopter. He's healed all the way back up with their satanic onto UK. They've got the ogre, and they'll take him down. In fact, they've died in the fountain almost. Rather, tier 3 towers. They won't bother, though. GXR, just two Raxes, basically for free. I say for free, they did win a massive team fight, but the team fight wasn't exactly tough for them either. Yeah, still really strong to have. Wondering who they prioritize the shard on this game. Looks like they won't back off, they know there's a bit of a fight. Yeah, Mizu, he's just having a bit of a roll around. Getting a lot of vision, that's a massive dream coil. He's got three targets again as Mamang Dyer. He is just melting to the flat cannon. This isn't a DK. He's just not tanky enough to be a DK. They call it. They have had enough, and my goodness, GXR. What a dominant victory here for game one. GXR, slightly. I don't think it's a complete outdraft. There are ways for EG to kind of play around it. UK is doing a great job of just throwing his body forward, getting the hits off to zone out Mizu. Does give a lot of space hold though. 
Cast. Yeah, Mamang Dyer, he does go for that dive on the Batrider. Yeah, you've got Mamang Dyer just kind of destroying Alacrity. And top lane, well, we're about to find out as Paulson, he does drop, but there's a rotation in from Alacrity. And Wami is going to go down on the LC. Lining up for mid, though. But that Void Spirit's just a bit too speedy all go. Oh, Lasso is there. Great setup again from our Batrider. Mamang Dyer getting his third kill of the game, but not in your dream. He's going to rotate on the Slark, right in onto LYM. Nice Fisher as well. Sure, they just lock him down, and that'll be a, a nice bit of bonus energy going the way of in your dream. Bot lane. I'll try and jump in onto Mizu. You've got no lasso, though, so it's not going to be that easy of a pick off, but they do jump in. Nice oh. Sonic Wave, though, with the Echo Slam, and now Mamang Dyer will be chased down. Alacrity, he has no more step charges, but they got the sounds off on Mizu. You wanted to keep going for a bit more. Even in your dream now showing up as Mamang Dyer, he's going to run out of the Firefly, but still runs pretty darn quick. Meanwhile, UK being dived into the T1 Tower. Flame Break's going to be there, Mamang Dyer. I'm not sure if this is worth your life, sir, and it is definitely not. As Polison, he will give the tip over immediately to Mamang Dyer, knowing that that was a very great trade for himself. As now, DB, he's going to try and get Joe Cam, but the salve is there. Joe Cam will be just fine. And Alacrity, he keeps forcing back DB. He's even going to try and go for this kill. Jump in on the Abaddon. For a time, immediately popped here by UK. Put the magic missile out. But in your dream, are we getting caught out now by the jewel? The Wukong's command is going to fly in as well. The jewel's not going to last long enough. In your dream, he'll just keep going. With the Shadow Dance, he is not afraid. He does get the kill and blink right out. But now... Because in the end, you are going to lose Polison. However, towards the top side, Mamang Dyer has been spotted. But they go after the Courier instead. They didn't see Mamang Dyer, but the Fisher, it's still going to land in time. And now the Pounce is out. Mamang Dyer, though, BKB up, Firefly out. He's going to go right in with the Lasso on Alacrity, but he blink strikes out of there. But rather, just Astral Steps. And now the Jewel's there. The hold down in your dream. But he has the Shadow Dance. And now the Echo Joe Cam is there in the nick of time to at least catch out UK. But AG, they're still going to be able to keep turning and fighting. Fisher out, not going to do too much as Joe Cam, he'll get knocked back into the Wukong's command. It's still a favorable trade here for Army Geniuses. GXR, they are going to continue to hold the triangle. It's in your dream, he's looking for a way back into this team fight. On to Mamang Dyer they go, press the attack is a little bit early there as the lasso still lands. Rub the pounce, it's in your dream, he does go down. They got a bit greedy but the Sonic Wave at least kill off the Batrider. Mizu now, gonna find his own way out. Just blinks to the south, he surely doesn't get out like this. Like he's, he's literally just standing there. TP away. Oh, he's oh. not gonna make it. Jewel is there in time, Mommy, he catches him. Oh, we're gonna find UK, it's not too bad of a target to start on. You do generally enjoy going after that Abaddon first, but the Jewel is out, and that's a lot of damage being pumped out from our LC. He's in your dream. He's just going to get blown up. Wami with the Blade Mole and Brigand's Blade just completely demolishes in your dream. Zalacrity, he's going to try and jump in and trade with DB, but a nice swap out from LYM, but Mizu, he's there with the Sonic Wave, and he does clean him up, but now Alacrity gets caught by the Lasso. It's a very slow target right now as he tries to hang around that Roshan pit. Just to simulate back up, but it's right into UK. It's not going to be much better for him. But again, the Eye of Scotty, he's almost about halfway through it now. In fact, he's, he's just about halfway through. So things are still going okay for GXR, but uh, as I say, that Lasso is there. The They've got policy. They get a support for their trouble. In fact, they might even get Mizu, who hexes himself up. He went for the pig out. It won't matter though. They haven't got the stunts to hold him down, but they might have the damage regardless of that, and they do. In the meantime, Wami does end up dropping to In Your Dream, however. Wami, I mean, that's a much easier target, I'd argue. They do spot him out, but they want Mamang Dyer. They, 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 need it. they need that Bat Rider dead, and they're gonna make the jump in, and they, it looks like they just blow him up. Nice and easy. Wami, gonna turn, Jewel. No, it's blocked by the Lincolns. Alacrity actually placed the Lincolns on Joe Camp just in the nick of time. Nevertheless, DB's gonna jump in. Oh, I am. He will save the day for this LC. 
As in your dream, might just be dead. Sonic Wave though, Wommy. He's gonna drop as in your dream. He's still trying to fight this one out. Still trying. As Polison, he does drop, but they get the Aegis down. Lacrity. Give him two nets. They've got to be careful. DB, he's still hitting like an absolute truck on this monkey. Bench, OIM, he's going to be alright. In fact, he'll keep chasing down Alacrity, but he's going to jump back in and clean up the bench. He won't mind, though, because you can still use all your spells, and he does break the Lincolns to make sure they can cancel the TP off. I believe that was still a, a favorable trade, again, for army geniuses. Just because Mamangdaya and DB are all the way up in that fort, uh, GXR, I think the big difference really lying on Mizu, basically, although... That's so well, they've got the slot in your dream. Oh, that's a massive kill. It's going to get much more difficult to do that as time goes on. They are going to try and run in with the smoke. OIM, it's a nice great double slot out. Fisher is there as well. UK, he's just fine. OIM, he's just going in. He wants to go for a swap. He does not care. Mamang Taya, though, he's jumped off the cliff. It won't matter, though. He's got the Firefly and DB. He's moved in. Lots of pulse, but no alacrity. He's a much bigger target. Wami, looking for the dual dust. Catch it. However, Global Science is there. Looks like they will not be able to hold him down. DB moving in. Mizu, big Sonic Wave down. It's not going to be enough yet, but they've got LYM. But Mizu, he's going to drop it now in your dreams. In big, big trouble. They've broken him off. He'll go into that Shadow Dance. Trying to chase down Mamang Taya, but he won't have the damage output. There's now Alacrity, still juking and jiving. He might just drop as well and does. The Balance Strike's there in time. DB, he's going to get jumped on by In Your Dream, but he doesn't care. He'll get the Wukongs off, and now the Lasso's out. Nice Fisher. In Your Dream, he's still alive. Love it In Your Dream, but Lincoln Sphere is there. Save the team, but Echo out, Mamang Dyer, he's gonna get blown up, and now they'll try to force a fight. In your dream, we'll go straight after LYM. Counts is there, Wukong's not out yet, DB, no, the Sans is out with the Global Sun. Maybe they can do it, but no DB. He does get the BKB off, and now gets the Wukong's command to a massive Sonic Wave, but they've lost Joe Camp. Wami to drop, but Lachary drops this as well. In your dream, we'll have to back. Now the dual Mizu does get caught. Aeon just gonna proc, it should buy him enough time to get himself out as in your dream moves back in on the slot. Take plenty of stacks away in those stats. He should be able to kill off Wami a second time and does get him. Alright, they'll get the tie back on Wami. Paulson, gonna be set to fall. In fact, Joe Cam, he jumped right into the boundless. In your dream though, UK is gonna drop. And that is a successful defense out. The supports get angry with you. I actually get angry when I carry D wards. I, I gotta be honest, DB. Big Wukong's command out. BKB's there as well. In your dream, he's got the Basher, so we'll try not just man fight this one out with the Dark Shroud, but the swap is there. OIM, he might regret that one because he's giving more stats away to this Slark, but now they might be able to turn with all these oh. ulties down and a boundless strike. A refresh up from DB. Paulison and Joe Cam are both down, and now the Lasso's there. Oh, what a great setup from DB! It's DB, kind of a, a bit of a pump fake on the back there. Mizu, so I'm gonna strike and connect. Lacrity though, gonna jump in, but the BKB is forced out. Global Science is committed as well. DB, he's gonna throw out the Wukong's command. I think they just really need to take this oh. Rex, but a massive Echo Slam Joe Cam isn't enough. The Sonic Wave is there. They claim two kills, but they still lose Mizu. And the duel is out, they've got Polis and Wami. He does secure a kill as Alacrity. He's desperately trying to secure this Wami kill, but they just can't get it. Press the attacks around and he's gonna make it. As Mamang Daya, he's got a lasso available in three seconds. Your dream. Be careful. Does back up. So Global Science times two. Always gonna feel very nice as DB. So start moving in. Fisher to block him in as Mizu is going to go right in. In your dream is there as well. They're trying to blow up this monkey king first off. BKB pop with Sonic Wave though. It's going to take him down. The first life is now Mamang Dai needs to get the hell out of there. He refreshes but these global Santas and now the Echo Slam Joe Cam. He locks them down. They just can't push high ground. They just can't do it. UK. And what do you do? You just stand there and take it. He's going to try and run. He will try, but he is not going to be successful. It's now the bench.
mid lane tier 3 tower gonna drop they've got buybacks but they don't really want to commit them like this mid rack's gone GXR, they're going to go back for the out of T2 tower. He does have dieback, but you don't really want to have to commit it. But he may have no choice if he makes the primal spring down. And he is going to do so. But no, they're going to go into the back lines instead. They found warming on the LC. Echo Slam being committed as well, but he's not dead yet. He gets swapped down. They do save the day. Onto the Slark in your dream. He just can't be killed. He'll go into that Shadow Dance. And he'll be perfectly fine as a massive Sonic Wave comes out. Mizu, he gets a double kill. Alacrity... DB. It's a three for nothing right now. DB is going to try and force the fight. Mizu, he's going to be all right. The depth is there in your dream. Still stealing stacks away. Back off again. You don't have another global silence either, so you do have to be a bit wary of that. Swap in onto Mizu, but he's going to blink out as now when your dream's jumped in. He's got the bashes off as well. The Lucky King. DB, he's going to buy back immediately. Lasso's there. Mizu gets caught, but they've got the Vengeful Spirit. LYM's going to drop, and Mizu, he does eventually go down, but he's going to commit his buyback immediately. It's a 3v5. In fact, another Abyssal Blade initiation in your dream. He's got a triple. Buyback committed. AG, they must be feeling really bad about this game. They played it so darn well. But GXR, they just don't give up. GXR finds those small mistakes and just build up. Mid creeps coming through. DB though, sneaking around. He's got to try. It's a last ditch attempt here from DB. He's got some heroes respawning soon, but look at the damage in your dream. He just gets to work. DB, he cannot survive it. It's a tieback on the monkey. He's going to rely on his teammates, but they call it. They do not believe they can defend any further. And GXR. Man, every time I cast these guys, they just impress me. Every single time, John. That is an impressive performance here for GXR.